right, so this is what the bandsaw looks like with this with this uh, citrus strip stripper on it, paint stripper. Um, after about um, 20 hours, maybe. So this stuff is peeled and ready to uh, take off with the steel wool. Um, so I'm going to get to doing that and uh, get this thing cleaned up so I can get it ready for paint. And this is pretty much the, uh, the last piece of the bandsaw that I have other than the stand over here um, to strip. And so I'm kind of excited to get, get the rest of this paint off. So I'll update you in a little bit. previous one I used um, some steel wool but I only have one piece left in my bag so the um, problem with that is it clogs up super fast so I'm trying to get the bulk of it off with a putty knife and wire brush so I don't blow through my last um, steel wool. Um, I'm going to try that and then a scotch brite pad to clean the rest of it off um, you know, with a combination of the wire brush some different things so um, but this this is surprisingly um, harder to get off than the other stuff maybe maybe because it dried on here but. all right so I just removed the tape after I got done painting um, top um, blade guard on my bandsaw so let me just show you what it looks like there right, you ready see this uh, pretty good paint job that I did and uh, kind of proud of it the way, way it looks and it looks pretty good <clears throat> So there is the paint job. Apart from from all the pitting here, from the rust, it's turned out pretty good. Um, as you can see, I what I did was I painted all this black first, and then I went back and taped around these these uh, these parts here. Um, turned out pretty good, I think. I was originally just going to paint this whole thing blue. Uh, this is all gloss blue, and I didn't sand in between coats. This is only two coats of black and then two coats of blue and I didn't sand or anything in between like wet sand um, not too too worried about that um, paint actually dried pretty fast too and this one has some pitting and the bottom one has quite a bit more pitting on the on the face over here um, the lighting's kinda of bad but um, that's the bottom one there I'm gonna do the same thing with this one as well as the the bottom part that I just painted or the the aluminum casting um, part of the bandsaw. I'm going to do the same thing with the taping and the blue blue paint on the outside here. Of course, this is the back side, but I don't care too much. Um, but that's going to have the same effect on the top and the bottom. Um, this only has one coat on here right now, so I probably will have to buy some more paint. I so I'm, I'm about halfway through my. Last can of uh, gloss black paint. Uh, this is turning out pretty good though. So I'll keep you updated as I as I keep going as I progress. Mm -hmm. 